Editing your tutorial videos takes hours, right? Watch this. I record once and the video edit itself. Zoom, cursor follow, clean background, done. The software that I'm currently talking about, it is none other than Foco C. Before the video starts, I want to clarify something. This is not a sponsorship video. I am really, really love this app. So that's why I just want to share with you guys. Let's start. All right. At the very first, go to their website. The link will be found in the description box below. Now click on free download. Don't worry. Foco C supports on Windows and Mac OS. So I will just open it after opening this app you will see three recording mode full screen custom window for now i will choose full screen then you will see multiple options let's start with teleprompter here you can write it down your script or that portion will be height during the recording part then you will see face cam option you can choose face cam hd camera and you can place it right over here or here wherever you prefer i'll just close it then you can choose your microphone it can be your macbook microphone it can be your usb condenser microphone it can be your zoom audio device whatever you have and last one system audio for the recording part you need to tap on record then it will start a countdown and now i will do a small recording and you will see the magic right after that as you probably seen, I just did a random video on Canva. Now I'll just stop this video here. All zoom ins has been placed and the best part everything has a smooth motion on it. Wow. Super smooth. As you can probably see, we have a very good clean background with a padding effect. That's why it looks so good. You can definitely customize it. There is canvas size and there is padding options. You can zoom it or zoom out it, whatever you want. Let's say five. And also you can change the inset or stroke, whatever you prefer. Let's say I will disable it. Then you can play with roundness. That means the corner. I like to go with 2% and also there is a shadow behind the skin recording. Either you can increase it or decrease it. And also within this click, you can change the background. I'll go with this one. And also you can add custom background. Just drag and drop the picture. That's all. And also you can choose with gradients and everything we will skip that part now the second option is very interesting this is a cursor option that means you can increase the cursor size as you can see the cursor size has been increased you can change the cursor style as well i'll go with this one and i will small it also you can add click effect sparkle ring spotlight size will be a little bit big and it will be white now as you can see it looks good and also you can use cursor click sound some people like it i personally don't like it but you can just play with volume one that looks cinematic and i prefer the soft one there are also multiple options like smooth it or you can increase the size or decrease the size you can also increase the microphone audio or enhance the voice this is another freaking best part basically whenever you click on your keyboard the button will be showcased on the screen as you can see you can play with the opacity you can play with the size If I play, you will see whatever I just tap on the keyboard, there will be a shortcut key. And definitely you can add captions, but for now, there is a limited language options. And lastly, if you want, you can add a watermark. Let's say <laughs> I like to add this. You can change the position like this is a pretty 
simple options anyway if you are happy with the video you can just tap on the export option you can definitely play with the export settings i will choose 1080p frame rate 60 fps quality will be higher and let's name it demo project by opera 14 and i will save it to downloads open export only one thing i would say is very negative about foco c they have a very bad export time you know every single video takes a lot of time for exporting i think they should work on that in this short tutorial i'm gonna give you how you can make a thumbnail less than a one minute using canva first of all search for youtube thumbnail perfect choose whatever you like let's say this one now click on the customize this template now upload a photo scale it if you want now go to position layers just down this picture perfect now just change the title of it Thank you so much each and everyone for watching this video. If you are new to the channel then please hit that subscribe button and press the bell icon. Please comment down below which specific option or which specific tools you will use most. This is Abra Fardin. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.